Make sure we didn't bring any warrants or operational plans. Because the last thing I this terrorist organization, that terrorist organization. Like Hannah is involved in prostitution, and Hannah is involved in human trafficking, which is what I need some sort of part. I may bring in a carpenter by busting the door in. I mean, I, I, I'm going to do whatever I need to do because it's, I, I, I destroyed the place going in possibly. It's my job. It's my job to secure it. A lot of times, I do like to wait for somebody to, to answer the door so I don't have to bring someone in to re-secure that door. Okay? Just so you know. And then the last thing we do, <coughs> after we execute this warrant, we all go back to the office and we all meet and we all talk. Why? Hey, I'm James, and I'm in the Administration of Law and Justice Department trailer, and with me today is Mr. Romanov. Mr. Romanov, thank you so much to have the time to be here with us today. <coughs> nice to be here. Now, I just had a couple of questions for you. Sure. Um, uh, what, is that? what do you have to do to qualify as a police officer? It depends. <laughs> I have to give you a hard answer. It depends. Sure. Some places require no college. Some, some places require two years. Some, some places require four years and some people are looking for advanced degrees. What are some of the challenges that have, um, in your time, in the law enforcement? There's a whole bunch of challenges. Um, sometimes it's just waking up because you're really tired. But um, I work on a lot of different types of cases, um, some very challenging cases, and um, um, usually it's the casework, long-term investigations, undercover operations, stuff like that. Um, have you ever had to draw your gun? Many times. I've never had to shoot anybody, though. How long have you become involved in, law, in the uh, law enforcement? Um, what made me want to become involved was that um, I don't like drug dealers and that they're doing, that they're selling drugs to teenagers on minors. Um, well, I've always been interested in law enforcement and learning about it, so when I found out about this class, I just wanted to take it to learn more to see if I wanted to really go into it and make it my career. With um, the drug dogs, do they ever get a, um, do they ever get high when they um, have the scent? I mean, because I've been wondering that for, for a long time. I never asked one if they got high, so I don't know. Um, I can't imagine, I can't imagine that they, that they get high. What have you learned so far in this program? Um, I learned a lot. I learned about the amendments, going in depth about it. Stop and frisk, um, the rules of the road, and just the guts. I follow your dreams. It's a great job. I think it's, and I don't view it as a job. I think it's a great career. It's something that you live. It's not just something that you go to from nine to five 